Hello Fox, uh, today I will show you uh, what is the need of view model in ASP.NET Core projects. Okay, let's to start. I have a student table looking like this with the enumeration type uh, gender, male and female. Uh, you can check this ID, name, gender and the course. Okay, so a single course have multiple students uh, the relationship between the students and the course table so course and course is id and name and the student is their id name and gender and i want to represent the data uh, looking like this ma uh, that manner suppose uh, your student table having uh, with the data is in the student is ID name gender student ID name gender and as well as the course ID because it's linked with the course table and the course table have the ID and the name okay so and I want to represent the data in the form of this manner like name here we have text box I want to put the data in the database table also name and uh, gender here we have male and female so you can pick uh, that table student because the name and gender is available but the course is not there <coughs> sorry and student have a single course so you can represent the course in the drop down also and the list of the courses is there so that table bind with the drop down list so what I do because here we have both table are used okay so create a view model so create a view model where your two table used like name in the view model name and uh, gender and the list type of course and you select the course one at a time so integer type of selected course okay so let's to try and uh, check it again there are two tables course and the table and the respective database is their student and the courses id and name student and course name and gender in the course we have some data itcs elef so first of all uh, create a controller okay use the private keywords for application db context you know it's a formalities underscore context ctor application db context for accessing the uh, data Assign with the context okay now uh, in the index method what should I do so first of all create a view model gain okay, student view model folder here you can create student 
view model create a class stu and the course class in which you can add uh, the property is it's uh, actually this model is not related to the actual physical it's a logical database that is not reflected in the main database so prop string name prop uh, gender Okay, and uh, I want to select uh, the gender also because it's a type of uh, the list, the selected list you can see. Okay, so. Um, prop i list and uh, here we have course courses prop integer selected course okay in the student controller First to add a reference of the student controller, sorry, add a student course reference, stu course s1 okay, resolve the issue. Now <coughs> Now resolve the issue and uh, access the item from the list by using the context. Context dot. I want to get the uh, all courses. So courses dot to list. Okay. Now add s1 dot courses is item now pass the s1 in the view that's simple and add a view here index create there is model class no context is used <coughs> sorry and uh, it's very uh, simple thing I can do here so selected course is there there is no need to uh, print and take it so first of all uh, replace the gender with the select list so remove the list and select as before is that is gender and uh, option value is 0 mail value is 1 female okay now the selected course is not uh, mandatory is here courses is uh, the label is courses and the select course there is no need of the label again or text box again use select ESP4 is selected course and the ASP items is new select list okay in the select list uh, you can add that type of matter 
or sorry parameters this types of parameter enumerable items select value uh, field and the text field and also selected items when you edit the mode you can use this in the edit mode so here you can use model dot courses id and the name okay so uh, this is the simple thing you can do here and run your code the student controller v in browser student index yeah is there male and female is there and it looking is simple and pretty so thank you very much for watching this video and uh, keep watching my all other videos thank you very much